Now let's say in this next example, I want to count the number of line breaks in this particular cell. I will of course use the substitute function, but first we need to understand how can we find out the number of line breaks. Logically, what you will need to do is that you will need to count the characters in this particular cell. Then you will need to substitute the line break and then count it again and then find out the difference between the two to give you the number of line breaks. So here's how I'll do it. First of all, I'll do a simple count of characters in this particular cell, which will be equal to len of this cell. Now what I'll do is that equal to substitute. The text is this one, comma, old text will be character 10. And then I will just put two double quotes, bracket close. So what it has done is that it has just removed the line breaks. This entire function I will put inside a len and it should give me the new character count without the line breaks. Now if I want to count the total number of line breaks, it will be this minus this and then minus one. So it will be equal to this cell minus this cell and then minus 1 which is 2. Normally when I'm writing a longer function I would just want to break it down into smaller ones and then club it together. So I'll do the same thing here as well like the last function that I need is in this particular cell. So what I'll do is that it is it is this cell minus this cell minus 1. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to just copy this cells function and paste it over here and then I'm going to copy this cells function and paste it here and then I can remove these two cells completely. So this should give me the complete function that I need to count the line breaks in a cell. And yes, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to get notified every time a new video is uploaded.